while I was in Matapalo, we went um, for an early celebration for my birthday. Also, we went to the river to this place with a lot of big stones. It was very, very beautiful. And uh, you said. Chocolate. Mm -hmm. See? Si, See? Si. Chocolate also. Because some um, enjoy very much chocolate. <laughs> so. Yes, so, yes, yeah. absolutely. And then the place in the river, you said the name is. Oh, um, uh, this is one place to my home, to this part is two hours in middle, mm -hmm. and the name is Carrosalillo. Yeah, it was a very, very beautiful place. Mm -hmm. um, Show pictures. Yes, we'll, we'll add some pictures in to this video. Um, but we, we rode on this vehicle. Uh, we'll try to post a picture to show the vehicle. It's, it's not something I had seen before coming to Peru, but it's very popular around uh, Sandra's town and the little towns around there. Um, it looks like the front is a motorcycle and the, it's like a, the back of a pickup truck is attached. Mm -hmm. um, and you said it has a certain name. It's called... Furgoneto. Oh, uh, for for Ganata, this um, mm -hmm. the how the, the this the, this matching mm -hmm. the automobile. Yeah, yeah. This this uh, vehicle the, or the vehicle or, from mm -hmm. this vehicle is uh, is very popular there, and the people climb in the back, and and so we went, and of course the road was very bumpy, and so we were going around, up and down, yeah, and, and the. the you know the people. We were screaming like it was, uh, like it was a yes. uh, the yeah. Ferris we are, you know. Uh, mm -hmm. yeah, this way, the happen also is very dangerous. If someone never before visit, lost lost very fast if possible. Um, lose uh, because it's very way for here, for here, for enter, mm -hmm. and it's one. Way very dangerous, but when you arrive, it's like say sun. It's beautiful. It's mm -hmm. the river, rocks, be for this. The person knows swimming. Mm -hmm. It's very nice because oh. the the water is tall. Yes, it, it was it was great. We we had a great time, um, and while we were out there, um, Sandro's sister. Uh, made ceviche So we had ceviche while we were out there and then we went back to this, went some more swimming yeah. and, and also um, teach two person swimming Ah, uh, yes mm -hmm. Tiara. Yes, yeah, yeah, Tiara, yeah, our niece, niece. Uh, niece. Mm -hmm. Tiara, she has care swimming and has her her Start mm -hmm. and, and she started alone swimming. Yeah, but by the end she was like a fish. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, she she uh, enjoyed it also. Mm -hmm. um, and uh, let's see. Then on on the way back, mm -hmm. you know, we were back in the vehicle again, and we were all ah. <laughs> um, and but you know it's because we we're going very fast and it's yeah. very bumpy very bumpy and, and this bicycle when i'm thinking the the way is very dangerous and with this bicycle is most dangerous <laughs> show picture for the this bicycle for his one it is. but it's very fun it's especially after when when i start riding the way more more quiet but our, our it, it was funny because our six-year-old nephew he he enjoyed it everybody is like going ah and like ah, you know and and he is just like this he's like ah. he, he enjoyed the everything literally literally he he is yeah and, and i remember 
and remember I see my sister for is the the mom. Mm -hmm. She I, I I see her close when happens something in the car. Oh yes, yes, it's <laughs> like a, yeah, she she's like, like <gasps> a he, Tiago is. <laughs> she likes uh, looks in one concert the rock. <laughs> <laughs> yes, yes, yeah, he was like. Yeah. <laughs> It's true. It's yeah, true. It was very fun when we finished, especially the, with the way. Remember everything and, and now we smile, remember everything, remember see the face, this girl, the other person. Mm -hmm. It was very fun. Uh, I, I think it, uh, we understand better when we can, when see the pictures and show. Yes, yes. Mm -hmm. well, we'll try to find some, some pictures to, so you can see the, the vehicle. Mm -hmm. But it was, it, was a, it was a lot of fun. Yeah, because also the way is to um, go for enter one mon mountain. Ah, uh, so, yes. Mm -hmm. And in the last, again, I think I write this, mm -hmm. is one river. Big and few big rocks around. Yes, it was it was amazing. Mm -hmm. I, I I really enjoyed I really enjoyed it. But then Sandro and I came to back to Lima, so uh, we're spending a few days here uh, before I go back to the United States. And um, so we we went to our uh, favorite hotel, the Hotel Estelar. Mm -hmm. uh, so we're on the 20th floor, mm -hmm. so we have a great view of the city. Um, so, well, little yeah. Video also. yeah, we're gonna we're gonna add a little video that kind of shows the panoramic view we have of the city from the window, and we can see the Pacific Ocean off in in one direction. So it's it's fantastic. Here is the view from our hotel room. You can see the Pacific Ocean out here. And as we go around, this is the view we have in all directions. Coming back around, down below is Avenido Larco. You can see we are on the 20th floor in our favorite hotel in Miraflores. And it's a beautiful view all around. And today we have a little bit of sun and so we can see the ocean and a mountain out there a little bit. Ocean close. Yeah, yeah, it's like when some days uh, Lima is very foggy and you can't see very well because it's very foggy and the fog is very low. Uh, but to but when the sun comes out a little bit, like today, you can see the ocean mm -hmm. and it looks very beautiful and you can even see a little mountain mm -hmm. that's out um, out there. Uh, ocean Pacific. Mm -hmm. Yes. Yeah, it's uh, it's it's very nice. Mm -hmm. yeah. um, and for those that uh, maybe haven't haven't thought about it all that much, when when you travel to Peru, uh, now in in the northern part of Peru where Sandro is from, it is fairly close to the equator, so it's warm all year round. Uh, now, Peru, but, but, but Lima, sorry, Lima, the capital, is further south, so it's further from the, the equator. Um, but it's still fairly warm all year round, but a little more cold during their winter. And the other thing, if uh, people remember from their geography uh, lessons, uh, when you're below the equator, the seasons are opposite. So... When it's winter here, it's summer in the United States, and when it's summer in the United States, it's winter, and so it's it's the opposite. Um, but in but in Lima, it 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 
kind of stays in the 60s and the 70s. So Lima has a very nice temperature all year round. More the 60s for their winter, more the 70s in their summer. So there's not a big, big difference, but it has a very nice uh, climate um, and has some uh, nice breezes coming off the ocean, which I think help keep it cooler. Mm -hmm. um, but so we were here in Lima for my actual uh, official birthday. And uh, so we went to this one store, or it's actually a series of stores. It's called the Mercado India. Mm -hmm. And it had a lot of Peruvian souvenirs and just Peruvian uh, nationality type things. Because so many things for um, what significant um, cultures. Yes. Uh, actually, uh, things, uh, the presents, for example, mm -hmm. t-shirt, for example, like that. Mm -hmm. Yes, found also, for example, I found this I like so much. Yes, yeah, it looks it looks really good. He's been wearing it a lot. Maybe the. Oh yes, I'll I'll show the. I got a, a very nice sweater. Mm -hmm. Very, very nice sweater with the, uh, as we would say in English, llamas, but in Spanish, llama, 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 llama. llama. So, and show the other. Oh yes. So also got this scarf which matches, and the thing that was really cool about it is that it has a hat on the end. Mm -hmm. So. You put it on, have the hat, and then the scarf continues. Mm -hmm. yeah. So that was kind of, that was cool. And it matches the sweater, so I got that. Um, then we got another hat, Let's see right here. Mm -hmm. And, oh. oh, and the other thing we did is uh, we've been playing chess, so we got a very cool chess set. It's very, very nice, and I'll, I'll bring it up close. You can see it has artwork you know, around and around the edges. So very, very beautiful. And then it had the pieces are very unique. You have here the the Inca. Oh, the, the, let's see here. Let's see. The, let's see. Inca, and then you have the Spanish. Spanish. Mm -hmm. uh, yesterday, player. And before, I choose for Inca and some for the Spanish. And when before I start player, I say I change the history, and <laughs> he win uh, in the two games. Hakemat. Mm -hmm. yeah. Checkmate. No, in no, English, it's... checkmate. You say it's haka, haka mate haka in mate. Spanish. It's in Spanish. Well, I, um... But he, but he is good. It's I mean, we we were we were very focused. It was like we were like thinking, and it's like it it was not very and it was not fast. We were we were thinking a lot because it was but it was it was a lot of fun. It was a lot of fun. Yeah. Uh, maybe we'll play again today or tomorrow because mm -hmm. yeah, it was maybe... enjoyed. Yeah.